So Arjuna has got a doubt. Sir, you said that the highest reality is experienced when all the vasanas are exhausted. And you are advising me to do all the obligatory duties. When I am entering into the field of activity and enter and try to fulfill the obligatory duties, am I not working? When I thus work physically, mentally, intellectually, will I not be creating new, new vasanas? When will I end these vasanas? So you, what you want is to end the vasanas. And your remedy is to create vasanas. Is not a contradiction. Krishna explains, you are right, my son. When you are functioning in the world outside, the end result of every action, physical and mental, even a thought that you have done, that, that same thought has got a tendency to repeat itself. You love a girl, you constantly remember. Whether the girl is there or not, if you hate a fellow, you go on hating. So will I not be creating more and more shackles? And these vasanas again will have to come out as desires, agitations and actions. So I am caught up in the same web again and again. How do you say that you now I must do the work? At the same time, you will be released from it. The teacher explains, when you work in the world outside with ego, and the selfish desires, vasanas are created. If the action undertaken has no ego in it, it never leaves any footprint in your mind. Every action undertaken with your involvement in it, it becomes a habit. Medically prescribed, and therefore you take an ounce of brandy every day b before meals, one hour before meals, because the doctor prescribed, you are in a very sad state of health to create appetite. You take it as a medicine, you will never become a drunkard. But ten days you take a peg or two with other friends, with the vanity that I am modern now. <laughs> my father has never done it, my grandfather has not done it. I am doing it. I hope everybody is seeing it. I am modern. With that idea, you take three days, the fourth day you want. 